everyone, welcome to another video. Today we're making a Lego Which is this one. See this? This is the one I'm making. Anyway, just stop it. Yeah, it's it. So just gonna do a build. So this is where uh this is where the assembled ones go. Aha. Wait, I, I wait. Uh, I think Trainboy made a Trainboy made a. All right, let's see. Yeah, I think Trainboy made a video about that once. Oh yeah, there, 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 there. Okay. Yeah, he made this one. Got this piece of shit. Oh, now I feel bad. Come back, dude. Anyway.
This is the P. Oh no, the black this black one. Black piece of Yeah, it's still anyway. I'm assembling the wheels cuz I like wheels first. I don't know why I'm putting on the wheels. They wanna. Anyway. It's looking good. Uh, anyway.
I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. You're okay. You could you could be worse. All right, so let's just build this thing. Let's get this whole thing. Okay, so this is just one giant diagram from the looks of it, at least for the engine. And yeah, the back is the assembly of the rolling stock. So let's just go ahead and build this engine, shall we? All right, so we're going to take this part here, and that's going to go like that. And then there's two little axles. And these little axles are going to go like so. Okay, don't tell me I'm missing pieces already. Where's the little red grill thing? Okay, here it is. We take this little bit and actually, never mind, like so. There we go. And this part here. Where's this little weird piece? All right, and this goes on the front and we need a little tiny black piece there all right so there's this thing i think the chassis block now it's asking me to build a fucking cab and i guess i'll be bothered put this one here and uh not good okay so this one goes like so and we should have another one yeah okay there's another one of these that we take this grill piece, this part here, and this part here. And this is the beginning works of our cab, and that fits directly over that black part on the back of this little chassis block. Wait a second, no, it looks like this goes a little bit forward. Yeah, and then we have this back piece here, and here we have to build a, I guess this would be the coal bunker, or a cab extension, perhaps? Yeah, maybe just a cab extension there. Right now we build this little, these little gold pieces are coming into action and we'll put these on the side or hanging off of the side like so. Um, next up we have this piece going here and looks like this will complete the smoke box on the front there. And we also have a little buffer beam to build. So let's go ahead and do that. And here's our little tiny buffer beam and that fits directly on the front of the engine like so. Looks like the smoke box door will be this green bit here and this gets a little black part on the front as well. And all right, we have to extend the cab a little bit more. Let's get this. Sit down, bro. Who the fuck asked you? Sit. Do you have a question? What do you want to tell the class? Nothing? Then stay in your spot. What do you do? Come on. You're holding everybody else back. Put together. Okay. So that is the completed cab, I believe. And here is the front of the engine. Looks like we just need the funnel and smaller details uh, now. Let's flip this thing over and finish off this engine, shall we? Okay. Let's see. Yep. Next up is the funnel. And the funnel is this long piece here with this now, this is different. I've never seen a Lego piece like this before um, that goes like that. And this fits right there. And there's your funnel. All right, we have a little beginnings of a steamer there. And it looks like this one gets actual wheels. This one doesn't have tires like the last one did. This one has actual little mock train wheels that'll go on either side. All right, and there is our... There is our Christmas 04 rope. Doesn't that look beautiful? Doesn't that just scream? I think Christmas, maybe like Happy Meals toy. I don't know, it's cute. It's a, it's a holiday train, you're welcome. And this one came together so much easier than this piece of shit did. And I, it makes sense, it's an actual Lego toy. So this diagram makes sense. I'm getting emotional, I need another drink. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, I hate to admit, I got a chaser. I got a chaser, I'm not gonna lie. This Jimmy Vanilla is not my friend. All right, so we have the engine ready. Um, actually, never mind. I'm missing little bits here. Um, there's a little whistle part that goes right there. All right, now the engine's complete. He has his little safety valve or whistle there. And let's get this rolling stock complete. So we start with this and this going together like so. Looks like this is our connector piece. Oh, okay, so this is a connecting piece and this is how they'll snip in together and such. So let's get that part 
built like so. And yeah, we just pop the wheels on this one now. Another good thing about these, you cannot put them on backwards. Uh, if you do, that's kind of your fault. All right, looks like I do this twice. So let's build a, let's do this all over again. One more time, guys. It's Total Drama Island revamped. It's Teen Titans Go. It's All Engines Go. It's Alien 2. Guess what? This time everybody's a baby. Nappy, uh, yeah, whatever. And then, it, okay. Okay, there we go. We have two little chassis blocks and they fit together like so. Look at that, look at that, look at that dangle, look at that dangle. All right, so for the first one, it looks like it's kind of just a flatbed and this is, all right, this one goes here and this one goes here, I guess. You take these parts here and they sit on the top. And, oh, okay, these little green bits are like little uh, bows on the top of the presents. Okay, so that is the top load for the first car. This will be your little flatbed, or I thought it was a tender, admittedly, when I first looked at the packaging, but uh, I was wrong. And it looks like the last one is some sort of passenger car, and for this one, you take this part, you take four by one greens, put them there. Um, here's your little doorway or entrance on the back and here's the one on the front now what windows of course windows you need to have windows let's put the windows there on both sides and i believe all that's left are these and this will make the second car the i guess passenger coach which honestly looks pretty cool this little the little transparent or mock glass pieces really it, it helps to sell it and these are your two cars once they're together and they hook to the train i did it backwards but they hook to the train like so can you okay you're really you're gonna embarrass me like that dude seriously ladies and gentlemen here is the little tiny lego train and there are a couple little extra bits let me just find random places to put them you know what you've been a pleasure to work with dude let's give you there we go you've been a pleasure to work with you deserve a second safety valve it just works here Okay, there's just a little extra bow right there. And here is your Christmas tree. It just came up. Why, Lego, do you hate me? I also just realized there's another bit. There's this little tiny black piece. So wh where's this going to go? You know what? That's going to that's gonna be a little... That's going to be a dome. Look at this engine. This engine is tricked out. He's got a dome. He's got double safety valves. He's got an extra bow on his little tiny flatbed. He's got a little coach. Wait, okay, now you're embarrassing me. No, 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 take the time. Think about think about what you've done I, and, and then give me an answer. Just think about what you've done. All right, which one do I like better? Um, probably this one because it feels more legit. It feels like a narrow gauge engine or something you'd see at like a, an amusement park that has a Christmas attraction. And this, this just kind of screams failed transformer design and um, I kind of hate it. But this, ladies and gentlemen, has been me making Lego trains in Toxic. I still have a little bit more. To, I have one more shot. Should I just take the shot? All right, let's just take the shot. <sighs> I feel so much better now. Either, either, either subscribe, donate, or get the fuck out. It's almost done.
the funnel needs to be finished. I don't think you guys realized the video you just pressed on. This is gonna be, this is gonna be something. So over the last little bit, I've obtained these little Lego trains. Here you can see we have the Lego Creator um, Winter Holiday Train. And this one is just a little, I guess, knockoff red train that I found at Entertainment. And I've had these and not done anything with them. I haven't built them yet. They've kind of just sat in their little prisons. And I've got the camera going. I've got some Jim Bean Vanilla. Um, I think you can see where this is going. Again, this is the only actual uh, licensed Lego set. This one is a complete knockoff. It's literally just called the Red Train from 3T Rail Productions. So, eh. and it's made in China. Who could have guessed that? I think I'm gonna need this too. Do you know how long it's been since I've made a Lego set? This is, and I'm handicapping myself. This better be a fun video. That's all I'm gonna say. You think the vanilla would help? It it really doesn't. It doesn't cut the bourbon much at all. All right, which one do we start with? I guess we'll we'll do this baby one first since it's the simpler one. I guess. All right. So here's our parts bit. Here's the instructions. Let's just. So I guess build the axles first. We put. Yeah, this and that. Are those the right? All right, this motherfucker got tires. Who wants to go off roading? This ain't this ain't no normal train. There we go. Okay, I had that one backwards, and it looks like there's two of those. So, and okay, so there's that. Now we need to take what? So this just goes like that. Okay. All right, so that sits like that, and then, oh, okay, so this part, this part goes like that, and then you have this flat bit that, okay, all right, that makes a little more sense. We have our little chassis block now, and I think you take this big bit here, and pop that on like so, oh, wait, oh, wait. No, I made a mistake. I've been, I've been going like this instead of like this. Uh, there's literally number. I'm so dumb. All right, now I'm confused again. It's cause this is wrong too? Okay, so take this off. And this goes there. Okay, so there's your coupler. And then we have these little bits that go like that on the front. Oh, okay. So this is kind of like a grill, I guess. And this bar just, just, that just fits. Look at that. That just fits in there this is okay all right that's as close as i'm gonna get it i'm gonna leave it there okay now you do the thing with these these go on the side here um so do this twice over boom boom i'm kind of just talking and we put okay you put these little bits here what now i'm confused again oh no these go here okay so put this there this one goes here, I guess. I need another drink. This is... This is too much. All right, so then this will go... Wait, no, because then it's that set's too high. I'm so... Why? Where do these come into play? Why would you put... Wait, no, I guess it's not wrong, because then it... What? Oh, great, now this piece is stuck. Come on, dude, don't... That's not what I wanted to happen. I cannot get this piece off to save my life. Please just separate. This is not even the exact I was gonna do it. Oh, this is ass. I guess I'm just gonna have to do it a little differently and accept that I'm stupid. So there's that. And there's a little thing there, but I, I can't help it. So this here is the boiler piece, I guess. And then you take, so you take the funnel, you go like that and then Wait, no, so the, tr this is the dumbest freaking build I've ever seen in my life. So this goes like that, and then this is your, this is your funnel, and the funnel sits on top like that. Then you take this piece here, 
that goes like so. Then you have the front of the engine. Okay, there's that. But why is the freaking boiler so tall? Wait a second. I think I get it. I think I get it. I think I see what I did wrong. No, actually, I don't. It's just, it's still, it's just like this. This is how the train ended up. It was supposed to look like... Oh, wait, there's more? How do you... No, there should not be more. What do you mean there's more to the... This is... The... There's no more pieces. How do you... Oh, there's two different ways to make the train. That may... Okay, all right. I'm done. This one sucks. All right, another drink in. Let's get with this actual Lego set. Let's build the real one now. Okay, let's... Yeah, this one looks like it'll be a little bit more complex, but hopefully we'll actually go together in a better way since it's a real Lego set, not this piece of shit. Oh, now I feel bad. Come back, dude. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. You're okay. You could you could be worse. All right, so let's just build this thing. Let's get this whole thing. Okay, so this is just one giant diagram from the looks of it, at least for the engine and... Yeah, the back is the assembly of the rolling stock. So let's just go ahead and build this engine, shall we? All right, so we're going to take this part here, and that's going to go like that. And then there's two little axles. And these little axles are going to go like so. Okay, don't tell me I'm missing pieces already. Where's the little red grill thing? Okay, here it is. We take this little bit and actually never mind, like so. There we go. And this part here. Where's this little weird piece? Alright, and this goes on the front. And we need a little tiny black piece there. Alright, so there's this thing. I think the chassis block. Now it's asking me to build a fucking cab, and I guess I'll be bothered. Put this one here and uh, now I'm gonna, okay, so this one goes like so, and we should have another one, yeah, okay, there's another one of these, then we take this grill piece, this part here, and this part here, and this is the beginning works of our cab, and that fits directly over that black part on the back of this little chassis block. Wait a second, no, it looks like this goes a little bit forward. Yeah, and then we have this back piece here, and here we have to build a, I guess this would be the coal bunker, or a cab extension, perhaps? Yeah, maybe just a cab extension there. Right now we build this little, these little gold pieces are coming into action, and we'll put these on the side, or hanging off of the side, like so. Um, next up we have this piece going here, and... Looks like this will complete the smoke box on the front there. And we also have a little buffer beam to build. So let's go ahead and do that. And here's our little tiny buffer beam. And that fits directly on the front of the engine, like so. Looks like the smoke box door will be this green bit here. And this gets a little black part on the front as well. And... All right, we have to extend the cab a little bit more. Let's get this. Sit down, bro. Who the fuck asked you? Sit. Do you have a question? What do you want to tell the class? Nothing? Then stay in your spot. What do you do? Come on. You're holding everybody else back. Put together. Okay, so that is the completed cab, I believe. And here is the front of the engine. Looks like we just need the funnel and smaller details uh, now. Let's flip this thing over and finish off this engine, shall we? Okay, let's see. Yep, next up is the funnel. And the funnel is this long piece here with this. Now, this is different. I've never seen a Lego piece like this before um, that goes like that. And this fits right there. And there's your funnel. All right, we have a little beginnings of a steamer there. And it looks like this one gets actual wheels. This one doesn't have tires like the last one did. This one has actual little mock train wheels that'll go on either side. All right, and there is our, there is our Christmas 04 rope. Doesn't that look beautiful? Doesn't that just scream? I think Christmas, maybe like Happy Meals toy. I don't know. It's cute. It's a, it's a holiday train. You're welcome. And this one came together so much easier than this piece of shit did. And I, it makes sense. It's an actual Lego toy. So this diagram makes sense. I'm getting emotional. I need another drink. 
<sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, I hate to admit, I got a chaser. I got a chaser, I'm not gonna lie. This Jimmy Vanilla is not my friend. All right, so we have the engine ready. Um, Actually, never mind. I'm missing little bits here. Um, There's a little whistle part that goes right there. All right, now the engine's complete. He has his little safety valve or whistle there. And let's get this rolling stock complete. So we start with this and this going together like so. Looks like this is our connector piece. Oh, okay, so this is a connecting piece and this is how they'll snip in together and such. So let's get that part built like Yay. so. And yeah, we just pop the wheels on this one now. Another good thing about these, you cannot put them on backwards. Uh, if you do, that's kind of your fault. All right, looks like I do this twice. So let's build a, let's do this all over again. One more time, guys. It's Total Drama Island revamped. It's Teen Titans Go. It's All Engines Go. It's Alien 2. Guess what? This time everybody's a baby. Nappy, uh, yeah, whatever. And then, it, okay. Okay, there we go. We have two little chassis blocks and they fit together like so. Look at that, look at that, look at that dingle. Look at that dangle. All right, so for the first one, it looks like it's kind of just a flatbed and this is, all right, this one goes here and this one goes. All right, I'm done. Here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use I guess. A nice phone. You take these parts the here the and they sit on the top. Anyway, bye. And, oh, okay, these little green bits are like Hopefully little. Hopefully you enjoy the video. Uh, yeah. bows on the top of the presents. Okay, Goodbye. so that is the top load for the first car. This will be your little 